Hi. All right, we should be good. Um, so, Hi, everyone. Um, hello, everyone. So this is usually our talking show with Miss Lori at Lori's World, where we do crafts and we chat and we have a lot of fun. But Miss Lori and Mima, her mom, are not able to be here because Mima is still at the hospital, as far as we're aware, because of her um, her knee mm -hmm. surgery. I think she dislocated it once, and then the doctors dislocated it three times, so she, mm. so she had to have another surgery. So we're praying for her, and Miss Lori isn't able to be here today because she is taking care of Mima. Okay. So don't do that yet. So we are going to be making some friendly rocks. Some pen kind rocks. Kind of. Kind rocks, funky kindness. and other words. Kindness rocks. We're going to be making some rocks, pet rocks. Pretty, pretty much, you just take a rock and then you paint it, and then you can make designs on it. Oh, and good. so I've already painted the background onto one of mine so that it would dry while we're learning about the other one, how to do it. So I've got this one that's already dry, and I have no idea what it's going to be. Yes, you do. No, it's going to be an avocado. Because we have a funny story about avocados. Yes, we do. That we've already shared a few times. Maybe I should make the other one a Benadryl. Yes. No. <laughs> yes. But anyway, hello, Rose Young. Um, it looks hello. like she was here as of 9.56. Uh, Carlos um, says that he, there's a storm and it might knock out his internet. So we'll be praying for you. And hi, Dad. And it looks like that's everyone who's here right now. So we're going to get started on the rocks then. So I started the background for this one, but we can get started on the background. Funky is right over here to um, our left. Um, and she's going to be making what? I'm going to make a bunny, our pet rock, and a minion. A minion. That was like my Hello, that is like my favorite cartoon ever. From yeah, Illumination. Min Minions was Bunky's childhood obsession. And then, so what are you making other than your avocado? We'll see. So I'm gonna take this acrylic paint, and this one's a lilac, and I'm gonna put it on this paper plate, hopefully where there's paper not paper some paper. green. Yeah, a little one. And I'm gonna. Hello, shift kicker. Hi, Miss Shift. Um, her internet is out, so she has to save her data. Oh, um, but thank sorry. you for stopping in and saying thank hi. For, thank you for stopping in. Looks like we have. Hope your internet the, fixes. Where's the white? The white is somewhere in here. Okay. That's antique white. That's white. So pretty much, you just very lightly paint on a background for your rock. And then we're going to paint over it. And for this one, I'm just going to do a nice lilac purple. It's going to be simple because the front, uh, the main event, is what's going to be the most evident feature of the rock. So you just want a basic, very simple background. And you know what? maybe I'll make it a little bit more complicated this time. Uh -oh. The avocado is just a green with a, a darker green uh, border and a little bit of a light green lighting. She's a troublemaker. Yeah. Hello, Jason CLJ. Tonight we are making pet rocks, rocks or kindness rocks. Um, and all you need is acrylic paint, which is what we're using, um, a paintbrush, and a rock. So it's fun. Oops. You can go fetch a rock outside, even. Yeah, you can use any old rock. Oh my gosh, I'm talking like I'm in the medieval times. He can't even go fetch a rock. Yes, go fetch yourself a rock. But people in the chat, how are you guys doing? Um, How's your weather this week? Well, I know uh, Mr. Carlos said that he was having There's, some storms. There was an another... earthquake earlier this week in like North Carolina too. Oh, I thought it was South wow. Dakota. North Carolina. Some, I think it was in Carolina. Mm. Um... <clears throat> But I mean, here it's been just like really, really? hot. It rained. It rained like hot. once once this week. Yeah, we had um, some really hot weather that was like 
in up in the week, 90s during finals week. Can I tell them what happened to me in finals week or is it too disgusting? The one where you fell in the pond? No. That wasn't in finals week. Oh yeah, Bucky fell in the pond or something. <laughs> what was in finals week? Um, we had some like really hot 90s weather during finals week. And then, I was the only one going out. Uh, not the only one, but she did end up taking on a lot of the chores while we were doing finals. So that was very, very nice of her. Jason CLJ says it's been sunny lately in Tennessee. He's been needing a thunderstorm. Yeah, we, us too. We, us too. Um, it, it's thunderstorm. been like in the 80s, 70s more often recently. Can I see a but we could definitely man? use some rain. Uh, Ro Miss one. Rose Young is dealing with smoke from Canada. Oh no! Eesh, I'm sorry. That's that's got to be awful. That's got to be awful. Okay, so I tried to go for a bit more of a gradient with this background. So it goes from a darker purple to a lighter purple. Cool. Not as gradient as I would have liked, but we'll we'll see. I'm just going with a white background because I like things easy. Yeah, so so uh, for the beginning of Bunky, oh, that's oh, cool. That is actually a pretty cool idea. Um, he's Bunky's minion so far. He's green. His neck is green. Well, yellow and blue make green. Yellow and blue make green. So I'm not surprised. Did okay. you still want to see a picture? Yes. Yeah. All right, I'm just trying to pull it up here. Oh, your face. Yeah. Which one should I make, Stuart or Bob? Up to you. Bob has two different colored eyes. I'm gonna start with the fox. I want to make so. Yeah, he's gonna make a fox. Uh, does anyone have black? Thank you. So once your background is painted, like my avocado, and and it's dried, you got to make sure it's dried, or else your colors are gonna mix, kind of like Funky's minions face did. <laughs> um, then you're gonna want to get a very fine-toothed, thin brush, like this one right here. And just take a little bit on the barrier black. Just take a little bit of black on the tip. Then you start painting it. Oh, so I can't use the same brush? You can. You can use whatever brush you want. But is it a good idea too? I need black. Because how thin you want your lines. Black it's going to vary a lot. Here you go. Then, yeah, I would stick with a thinner brush. So just like that. Mm -hmm. I haven't so noticed my smoke in Tennessee, but people in Ohio. All the way down in Ohio? Wow. Wow, that must have been a pretty big fire. I mean, we have smoke here Canada. with bad lights fire, bonfire. Oh, we forgot to change Nightbot. Oh, no. It's still fe featuring Rich Cat from last Type week. Type in Nightbot TV if you want to fix it. No, I think it'll it'll be it'll be okay. So just be ignore good. Nightbot. He's out of his mind. Yep. So I'm just going to... Where do I start? With the tail? Or the face? I would start with the tail. Just to Maybe make sure start with the nose? Uh, I'd start with the... Start Cause... with the back. That's where I'd start. Okay. Oh, nice. This is very nice. Is the very paint, nice. like, permanent? So it's acrylic paint, so it's going to wash off really easy. Um, if you're going to put it outside, you can put um, some sort of sealant on it. Um, I forgot what it's called. We, were, we, we tried to use it that one week with the... Um, the, the the ball jar ball lids, jar lids. but you there's there's see. spray on sealants you can use to make it permanent. Right. Um, hey. I don't know what I'm doing. Thank you. What if I write a B just to be you know? Can I borrow that for a second, Jeff? Mm, no, I what? need black. It's black, so it won't wear on it. But I need Guys, it because it's they're stealing my reference photo. I just want to look at something. Uh, hey, so I'm sorry. Rude. You got the black over by you. I have black. She is black. Damn. I'm not done yet. It's going. Uh, ah. That's its pit. I'm gonna add some brown to the pit. No, it's it's avocado pit. <laughs> it's it's avocado pit. Duh. I hear you. I don't know where the fires Thin come from. Here, I'm please. tired of watching world news, right? Mm. Hey. 
I just hope everyone's staying safe. Yeah, it's, smoke can be a real problem for inhalation sometimes. And people with asthma. Yeah, and people with asthma. KK would know. KK would know. Yeah, the only real trigger for me recently is allergens. Yeah, that's allergens. That's also allergens. Yeah, no, I'm just giving examples of your oh, allergens. Oh, got it. People. Hello, Fallen Arkansas <gasps> veterans. No, Mr. Charles. No, you're fucking crying, black tears. <laughs> no. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. I can fix it. I can fix it. I need a clean brush. But hi, Mr. Charles. Um, people leave the painted rocks all around here for people to find. That's so cool. Oh, that is so they cool just like. Idea. That, that's a really cool idea. Look at it, Jack. So you can just, like, find painted rocks everywhere? It's not a bad idea. Just leave them for people. Cheer them up. Give them something nice. I love it. Or not nice. Depends how good of an artist you are. Yeah. <laughs> Soon I'm going to add the white to the side. And then the scrap. Mm -hmm. It's going to be that Okay, so I'm going to add here. Here's my avocado so far. Maybe he needs eyebrows. What do you guys think? Should I add eyebrows to the avocado? Yeah. No. 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 Actually, yeah, it looks like it could use it. But he needs like one of those little white streaks in the corner, white tips in the corner. Yeah, it needs to dry for a bit first. I have a white. Um, oh, that's what you mean. What do you reference? But here's mine for now. I'm making a box. So. Oh, he's cute. He's he cute shape. Oh, it's so cute. What's the upper view of foxes looking? I like foxes. They're cute. I don't blame her. Oh, that's turning out really well. Show the camera. Thanks. So I added some brown to the pit so that it didn't look like its mouth. That looks a little better. Um, also, if you could show Bunkies, that'd be great. Okay. Is Bunkies minion? You know what I should have done? What should you have done? Checked if I had orange. Oh my gosh, if you don't have orange, what are you going to do? It's empty. Oh no. I'm going to be right back. Wait, That's a problem. You can't do a fox without orange. Here. Uh, here. The white brush. This is orange. No, that has orange bristles. So, is there anything new with I saw everyone your in the chat? I your paintbrush. Hey! No, 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 no! Is there anything new with everyone in the in, in the chat? Is there any new things in your garden? Yes. Anything new but in your the white homes? is over here. Can you your lives? Pets lives? Ow. Ow. Ow, what? Here, Kayla, you can have your plant paintbrush back. Okay. <laughs> that almost got me in the face. Yeah. Oh. I'm, I'm we should so do pet painting week. Arkansas veterans. We yeah. should not. I no, just like life. whoever whoever behaved the least over the last week has to be like the. Okay, campus. but I'm allergic to lights. That's not fair. Oh. And Bunky can't come onto the screen, so it's got to be you. Oh wait, no, that's not fair. Let's not do that. <laughs> I have skin allergies, so it can't be me. And Bunky can't come on the screen, so it's you. Here we go. Oh, that's why it has a. What a color art is. Yeah, it's on me. Watercolor art is very hard to control when you're painting. Hey, Bunk, you have that napkin It's not the there. end of the world to have paint on your fingers. Oh. Your... That's not for oh. paint fingers. Oh. It's for drying up your paintbrushes. Yeah, so paint is messy. Paint can be messy if you're not careful with it. It's not drying yet. It's like the baby animals. If you're not careful with them, they can be very messy. Hello, Red Scout. Thank you for coming in. Um, Hi, Red Scout. Some cool people. <laughs> you're talking about the guys in the chat, right? Aww. <laughs> well, I pull Bunky, too, but you can't see Oh, yeah, her. Bunky, too. Um, Rose Young says that the people who leave pet rocks, are they put the town and state they live in. So that you know how far the rocks traveled. Oh, that's really cool. That's super cool. That's an awesome okay, idea. I want to do that. Carson, nineteen fifty four. Hello. Um, we're painting rocks tonight. I don't want black. Mm. 
This is one hair is too long. Yeah, mom has this cool story of oops. <laughs> about about um paint painting rocks um in a Jewish cemetery. Oh yeah. She said it in the chat, but they have a tradition of leaving a stone when they visit a loved one. Oh. Yeah. Purple. Do you ever, like steal those stones? That would be awful. No. It's Purple. it's like it's 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 symbolic. It's like it's a gift. Right. Purple. Um, hello Suzanne e. Goulet. Purple, please. Do you have Purple. one done that we can see? So no, we do not. We do the not. only We've pet rock I, the only pet rock I've made before was oh, you want to in, it's, in, it's in it's in fifth grade and it's just like this big rock it's that I stuck googly, googly eyes on googly eye. <laughs> and that's, so that's pretty much it. Here's um, my avocado so far, but that's a rock that Trey turned into an rock. avocado. Yep, this was the original rock, and this is the avocado. This is my first time making uh, pet rocks, so I'm sorry. hello Bushcraft family. Thank you for so, coming in, guys. Have we decided eyebrows or no eyebrows? Eyebrows. Eyebrows. I thought it was the she other way around no. like 10 seconds ago where you said eyebrows and she said no eyebrows and now it's see Bunky and I are good like that we team up to make life Hi, difficult Carson, for you. Yeah. Could yeah. you please paint my face on a rock? I'll paint. <laughs> mm, I, I don't I'm do not very faces. good at faces. I can do like um, caricatures of people and I might open requests back up for those one of these days, but I haven't finished with all of um, the things. You haven't made my caricature. You didn't ask me to. I did. I animated you for your I intro, remember? You my sleep. Why did you draw Newt's eyes on your paper plate? Newt's eyes? Yeah, it's purple. Aww. Oh, you said his name. No. no. The spoilers. Oh. Yeah, there's this random person named Newt who has purple eyes. Just a spoiler. <laughs> He's just missing around. Yeah. Uh, where are we finding these rocks? <laughs> Amazon. Funny story. We're finding we, them um, on Amazon. We went hunting in a forest. It's the Amazon. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> we went hunting in the Amazon rainforest. <laughs> we did not. No, they're just um, rocks that we got off of Amazon because my rock collection are, is really small. And they're really pretty rocks, my rock collection. Look, my hair is painted. But we needed flat and big, so we had to go for this. Oh no, Bunky painted her hair again. Oh, oh no. I took off the I'm thinking thing. zigzag southwest native art type of style. I don't know. Oh, that would be Native American art kind of thing. Oh, that'd be cool. That. But I have already have my two rocks planned. Okay, so I think I'm done with my avocado. So if you want to use that as the finished art, this is my rock. Ta -da, ta -da. Where's the dye brush? I don't know if I want to add dye brush. I don't. I don't know. like it. What do you think? Yeah, leave it. I think it's done. Okay, so. No, avocado rock brush. is done. Now, it would appear that my purple background isn't quite done yet. Can I So I'm going to let it? it sit for a little bit on the top. But for the bottom, or, or on the bottom where it needs to dry. But on the top, I'm going to get started on my idea, which is going to be an emu. Hey! And emu no rock. one can stop me. Emu rock. Except for emu. emus, because they're hard to draw. They can easily stop me by being hard to draw. What? I'm talking to myself. Is that a rock? <laughs> Your avocado might be a little crunchy. <laughs> <laughs> it might be a little crunchy. Well, you know, KK loves avocados. Do you want to try it? How dare you? Are you okay? <laughs> <laughs> what so if that? we could show Bunky, she is laying on the floor with one leg up on the couch, cackling after having fallen down. I don't even know. <laughs> Painting a farm old barn and Fence would be cool. That would be cool. So how come I can't do more than two rocks? Because we are designated two rocks. <laughs> okay, so I've got the basic dandelion-ish shape for the emu's head, but I think I'm going to make it bigger. There's no gray! Uh, Bug, you don't need gray. Just do black. Yeah. Or you, you can, can make black, and, black white. and white. Ha -ha. Here, I'll show you how. I know how. So, no, 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 you already have. 
So this okay. is all I can do on this for now because they need the orange to dry before I can make a face. But there's my little box. Lucy. Oh, it's cute. You can add the leaves. Oh yeah, I can do leaves. Um. Okay, so I can work with that. Um. You know. Oh, thank you, mom. Minion picture. Please. Dad's dad moved a lot of el elderberry bushes. Oh yeah, dad moved so many elderberry bushes. I helped. I've been watering. Yeah, Bunky helped too. I've been watering them these past two days, and I think there are at least twelve to fifteen of them that are out there. It looks like pretty. they're so cool. All right, now I need to add some. Um, do we have like a red? I kind of want to mix a little bit of red into the orange that I have left. That's a good idea. I don't know if we have red though, because I used a lot of it for my lava art. Lava. Oh yeah. Yeah, remember with Miss Lori in our past lives. That sounds like oh dear. That sounds wrong. Yeah, our past like live streams. I'm so bad at art. So it turns out I am very very bad at mixing paint. Yeah, that that makes pink. Was that what you were going for? Yeah, I was going for like a little more of an autumn scheme, so I kind of like it. But like now it's all over my brush. <laughs> Okay. Aren't you gonna use your brush? To yeah, but paint? it's it's too it's too much. I gotcha. I got you're already you. set on a rock. You set on a feeling. Now I'm not sure if that's a, a reference to like the Bible. The Bible, because he's a rock you can lean on. Lean on. <laughs> oh my gosh, have I told this story? No, you have not. Oh my goodness. So like, um, I think it was a year or two ago. Um, we mom got us these tracks. little Bible track things, and it's like Awana Sparks, but for older people. Yeah, so that's like us. We're older, thir people. thirteen to seventeen. Mm -hmm. So yeah, we're older people now. <laughs> yep, that's us. We graduated to the older people club. A. <laughs> um, oh, but anyway, um, yep, you and your little whipper yourself. The prompt of the day was to like describe was to describe um jesus okay i was i like meant pillar <laughs> i meant pillar but i didn't have the word <laughs> cut me some so slack. Like, jesus is the pole i can lean on <laughs> he is and yes you bring up a good point he is but no one leans on poles i lean on poles the poles that hold up the ceiling <laughs> The ones in the basement, the red poles that hold up the entire house. Those are not poles. Yeah, they are. They're not poles. No. Yes. They're, they're, they're like new thing pillars. No, they're not. They are. They are poles. They're weight. I they're, have heard dad call them their poles. Are, are they poles? Is that what they are? Yeah. Because they're, they're weight weight bearing. So I would assume that would make them a pillar. Poles bear weight. <laughs> Genius. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. What's yeah. happening? No, it's on my pants. What's happening? I'm dropping We're stuff. That's what's happening. We're arguing about whether the red things downstairs, the one that hold up the ceiling, the ones that I try to climb a lot, mm -hmm. are those poles or pillars? Poles are metal. Poles. Pillars ah. are like, <laughs> if you look at yeah, like ancient uh, Mr. Rome, Bushka, pole poles. deck. No. The pole's named Jack. But you can't just say someone is like a pole. So how come Mr. Charles got to name our poles? I mean, what if I didn't want to name them Jack? That, 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 what if I didn't, wanted to name them where Jack? Where did that thing go? Jeff the pole. <laughs> hey, Jesus I gotta, the oh, pole. I mean, I, oh, Jesus. Are you using that? Oh, Trey. What? That one was mine. It was not. Yeah, that's the black one that I was using. The black one that I started. That I had first. I started this pole. That's fine. I can use this one. Are you gonna say cold? Hello, Huga Homestead. Thank you for coming in. Hi, Miss Huga. Hello, Miss Huga. We're painting rocks. We are painting rocks. Here's my avocado. Miss <laughs> <laughs> like, Laurie, you're missing Hi, out on all the fun. Hi, Miss Laurie. When will Bunky get back into the lives in three when I'm years? 13. Um, YouTube says she's not allowed back on until she's 13. Or I'm going to wear a grill. So we've got three years. 
But she's still right here, and, and she's if you guys want to see updates. her adorable, uh, squishy little young face, you can go to her channel, what? which is at Bunky Town, which used to be Bunky's Garden, but is now Bunky Town. And it is it's the most dead. awesome channel ever. Yeah. Oh my god, he's so cool! What, you added an eyeball on his belly? No! I can't see it. It's oh, a it's a pocket. I can see it. It looks like that was where his eyeball was. Eyeball I can see it very well. I was looking through it. That's really cool. That looks awesome. That though. is super cool. That's really cute, Frank. You need to start a new bunny meal? No. No? I have no shoes. You have no shoes. What does your shoes have to do with For the your... minion. Oh, the minion has no... <coughs> oh. I gotcha. I'm in the loop now. What? What? <laughs> I didn't say anything. Uh -huh. Did you say something? Here's One leaf is done. That took like 20 minutes. <laughs> I can't see it. Okay, so Yay! it didn't take 20 minutes, but it took at least eight. For like this one teeny weeny little leaf. And I have to do another add like three. Mima is still in the hospital. She was able to sit by herself today, but we may be looking at somewhere for her to rehab for a while before coming home. She's not quite ready to be without care. Well, we'll be praying for her. We'll be praying for um, her. It sounds like a lot of pain. Yeah. I know you said the doctors are keeping track of the pain. Mama likes it. Yay, Mama likes it. Yay, Mama likes it. it. Like now I just gotta blotch up this little dandelion thing. Oh, that looks so cool, Trey. Okay, so I tried to blotch this up. It's supposed to be like dandelion kind of thing. Does that look like a green dandelion? I think it looks really good. Hey, don't get paint on my screen. Don't get paint on my screen. I think it looks... I, need one. I think it's good. Alright. So, so next wait. I just oops. Next I just need to add the face. I've said thing the bobber. Okay, so this this next leaf is actually going a lot faster. Good. So I think I just needed to know what I was doing. Yeah. <gasps> and tragedy. Tragedy. Oh no, tragedy. Don't ah. bump into my leaf. Don't bump into me. Oh, you're talking to me. Yes, I'm talking to you. I was just trying to narrate your life. I'm sorry. Grape Jams thinks it's going to be an emu. Um, Ms. Lori, if you want, you can still come up and join us, even just to talk. We sent you the link. We sent you the link already. And we don't really know what to talk about without you here. Mom, sing my bass. Daddy, sing. Oh, hang on, you're giving my bike. Um, yes, you're right, um, Mom. It's going to be an emu. It's going to be a dandelimu. What? It's a dandy emu. You know, like a dandelion, except it's an emu. It's a dandy emu. <laughs> Fallen Arkansas veteran surgery went well. He has some bruising on the leg they work on. He still has to work on the other one in six weeks. Oh. That's amazing. Well, we're, we're glad well, that we're went, glad really it went well. Well, we're glad it went well. We hope the other one goes just as well. Yeah, we'll be praying for you. If I don't make the, it, the brush is doing this enough. blotchy thing. Can I have the thinner brush when you're done with it? If I don't make his people big enough, he's going to look psychotic. I'm gonna see if I can add more. Maybe I should make him look psychotic. We had a thin purpose. brush. See, like I don't know why this leaf is giving me so much trouble. Uh, because it's a leaf. Trouble. It's just a leaf. The leaves do that. Carlos made it. Hey. Yes, I'm making an emu. Gonna be a. Can I have that one? Oh, yeah, wait, it's a feather. I messed up in the paint. Black paint smeared. Emu. It's an emu. Yeah, I should. 
Sarawo. Yeah, we can't tell Miss Laura. We have no idea what we're doing. Mom may it always be right, but she's Mom may always be right, but she's never wrong. May not. May not always be right, but she is never wrong. That is true. <laughs> I may never be right, but I, but I, I may. I'm Trey's right. equivalent for that is a little bit of the opposite. Yeah, I may never be right, but I'm always wrong. Always I may wrong. <laughs> No, no, that's not how I I'm may right. not always be right. No, I might not always be wrong, but I am never right. Yes, I may not always be wrong, but I'm never right. There it is. What? Wait, go back, go back, go back. I, I don't see get him. this saying at all. It means I'm always wrong. No, the original. The original saying is that while he might not always be absolutely correct, he's never incorrect. There's that little gray area in between there. Huh? I have to have my arteries ballooned open. They were clogged. Ooh, Ooh. that sounds invasive. That does sound very invasive. Well, we're glad it went well. Can you go back to the... Uh-huh. Daddy, Thank you. Sing bass. I sing so, like, I don't know. I, I forgot that I had to add white. And now it's... Oh, no. And now it's going to be over my outline. So I'm going to have to redo my outline after that. You should be okay as long as nobody shakes you. Mm. 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 These are so hard to draw. What? 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 Oh. You got paint on your leg. Uh, two okay, of them. Oh, Miss Rose, Rose is gonna have a leg and knee surgery too. Wow, we'll be praying for you guys. Yep. Um, it's so cute. I'm gonna borrow some of your orange for his beak. Or maybe I should make it the pinkish for his beak. I think do a test area. I'm gonna go pink to see if it like complements the colors. Does anyone it have does. a dark orange? I just did this kind of stuff. Does anyone have a dark orange? Oh, it's gonna look so bad. Dark like, uh, your rabbit shouldn't need color that. Color no. Orange. We don't have a dark his orange. His eyes need to be... Why, Why do his eyes, eyes need, need to be orange? orange? Jinx. Kayla. <gasps> How dare. Grail. <laughs> Mutiny. K-K. Man overboard. <laughs> K-K. You can stop saying her name now. K-K. Don't rub in the mutiny. Oh, well, don't poke the bear monkey. Okay. My first mate has betrayed me. Okay. It's a very good verse, Jason C. L. J. What is it? Psalms 37, 7. Rest in the Lord and wait patiently for him. Fret not thyself because of him who prospereth in his way, because of the man who bringeth wicked devices to pass. That is a really good verse. Is this about the pole thing? I was huh? Is this about the pole? <laughs> No. I, I was um, talking to the dogs because folks keep fighting to them. And I kept reminding okay. him of three verses. The golden rule. Oh my gosh, you're giving mm-hmm. the dog biblical scripture to make him behave. Mm-hmm. All right, here's my email. The golden rule. He so looks angry, so it's Griffin. It was going to be Buckbeak, but it turned out to be angry, so it's Griffin. What does it need? Should I add the little nugget wings? Yeah, sure. Where? Bunny, please. Like down, like down there. I'm gonna add the nugget, the nougat wings, the little. The, the only way we know that they're related to the dinosaurs, that and the evil behaviorism. The evil behaviors? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. You've seen Griffin? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I understand what you mean. <laughs> Griffin keeps trying to like, I don't know, the head kicker. It's something like I that. Hey, it. no, I had it first. I'm not done yet. I need a I'll give it to point. you in like a minute. I'll give it to you in a minute. I just need to add these little stubby arms. Which is rather ungrateful of her, considering that, like, hey, you paid for her. I paid for her. It's just, like, rude. Rude. Well, Everything I mean, that's mean to you Maybe it's just your face. Maybe it's my face. Maybe she just doesn't like your face. Maybe. That's me. She's a Karen. I should have said that. Yeah. She's a mean emo. Um, she hissed at me the other day, but I got her under control. 
I got her under control. Well, you gotta assert your dominance on them, or else they're just gonna keep doing it, and then you're gonna get hurt. And we can't have emus that hurt us, because then they're gonna hurt our little whippersnapper over here. Our little whippersnapper over here. Emus are right out of Jurassic Park. If, they are. They if, are. They are. I've never seen that movie. Oh, if, I think I saw a little bit of it. I think once. I remember I was a little we were older really than Bunky, little. and that was horrifying. I only remember like this old dude running through the woods, getting t- chased by a T Rex. Wasn't that in the new ones trailer too? So that could literally be anything. Oh. Okay, guys, clarify. Is, was there an old dude running through the forest, being chased by a T Rex? Funny. I'm sure mom Did and dad have seen it. I'm sure they have. I mean, they watched, like, Abraham Lincoln the Vampire Slayer. Hey. It has nothing to do with Jurassic Park. I'm just saying if they could watch that, then I'm sure it's fine. Oh, what is the flashing at the bottom of the screen? I don't know why. It's probably not plugged in all the way. Our webcam acts up every now and then. And it'll have a little red flash at the bottom of the screen. But it's been doing that all live. Um, I'm not really sure why it's doing that. I'll try to pay attention the next time it flashes. I'm not sure. But it's just been glitching. I think it's just not. She might be talking about that red one. No, not that. There's there's a fire. Yeah, it does kind of glitch. Whippersnapper. Yes, I got that from our choir teacher. Oh my goodness. (laughs) He would walk in. He was a funny teacher. You young whippersnappers. Yes, he would call us whippersnappers. And then he also had the penny flute. And he walked in as Jack Sparrow once. He was the coolest band teacher ever. He was the coolest teacher ever. Penny, please. Oh, and then you, I, I need that, guys. That's a mini. Oh, yeah, I'm working on it. There, there's your button. Uh, let me see here. So what else should I add to the emu? What does she need? Daddy. Also, does the avocado need anything? Does look so cool, Trey. Like what? Like what? <laughs> like what? What do they need? I Should guess. I write her name on the top of it? No. Should I write KK on the avocado? Hey. <laughs> should you put a drop Benadryl? Or should I put on the back? Oh, Benadryl on the back of the avocado. Good idea. Hey. We love There's this camera. one stray hair on the brush, and it's making my yeah. I was having that issue painting earlier dilemma when I was so much harder. It. Yeah, when I was trying to draw the avocado's eye lighting. You did lighting. Yeah. Jealous. She's ahead of her time. Your emu needs a tie, Miss Lori says. <gasps> My emu needs a tie. What color tie should I give it? It's a green emu. So what kind of what color tie? Should it be a bow tie or like a neck tie? What's it called? Bow tie. That's where awesome. where on the neck should it like it be at the top or like in the mid or at the bottom? Bunny. Yeah, that's a very good idea, uh, Mr. Jason. Um, verses are a great way to find comfort. Um, and I'm not sure why you need prayer, but I'll be praying for you. Um, but that's also a very good verse. The communication of thy faith may become effectual by acknowledging of every good thing which is in you in Jesus Christ. That's a good one. It's kind of reminding me of the... Um, and there. Now you guys don't have to... God is love. Fight over the... Okay. Uh, I'm not remembering the entire verse. It's doing verses tonight. Kind of fun. Yeah, that is pretty good. Purple with green dots. Purple with green dots. Long die. Miss Lori, you are amazing. It's just a genuine. Fact. You have to go with the darker green, though. Otherwise, it's not going to go with your. Yeah. Background. And where on the the neck do I start the tie? At the bottom. I'm done. Like where on his neck? Like at the bottom or like up at the top? Where and on the emus? Like up here. This is option one, right. two, and three. Where should I put the tie? So like, do you put it at the top of the neck or the bottom? I don't know. That's what I'm trying to figure out. I think it would be at the bottom. I should get Buck Beak a tie, a purple one with green spots. Have you guys seen the shorts we did with Buck Beak? It was the cutest thing. So we got these little hoods for him. I haven't made them yet. You haven't made them yet? You haven't made them yet? I know. Funky does a lot. She does. Okay, with a pink outline. Okay. Okay. All right, can I have the green? 
Okay, I've got a one and a, a two. I've got two ones. And one, uh, thank you, two. Mr. Charles. So up at the top. No, wait, pink. Wait, you can do pink. It's going to be a pink outline. It's going to be purple with green dots and a pink outline. Pink outline? What outline? Outline. Oh. See, she just thinks complicated. It's not my idea. It's just Mrs. LJ's idea. Just like... It looks like she has a chicken wing on her face. I need a thinner brush. I'm just going to start by drawing my little background. Oh, yeah. You haven't started on your other rock yet. I found this very adorable picture of a kitten. Oh my goodness, my screen is so dark. <laughs> <laughs> like you guys can't see anything. But yeah, it's hard to see. But that's yeah. a kitten, and I'm gonna yeah. try to put it on a rock. The tie needs to be longer. I'm also trying to use up trace paint, so it's double purpose. Don't use up trace paint. I can make more rocks. We don't have this many rocks. Mm. We're allowed to use. Okay. Okay, so I got the purple part done for, for the tie. Oh, you guys can't see the, the part that goes around his neck. It's too dark. Maybe not. There it is. Okay, so he's got his tie. And now I need to add the Easter emu. That was adorable. That was the bunny. The bunny. Okay, he loves those little hoods. Dad put the link. You got. You guys need to see that. The He's got these email. little hoods. And so the first thing we tried to put on Buckbeak was this little scrunchy thing that we put around his head. And it looked like he had a little bonnet on. And he kind of like folded up on himself and pouted. And it just looked like. No, that was a scrunchy. Yeah, the little hood. It was a little scrunchy. It looked like a bonnet. And he just pouted. Hey, um, expert artist, how do you blend these? Blend? Oh, simple. Is this very striking? You, you making it out of that? It is a cute cat. No, I'm not. Man. Good night, Rose Young. Thank you for coming. I don't know. Okay, how do you open You have to, like, take off. You have to squeeze really hard and then take off the seal. Oh, wow. You got a lot of paint in here. <gasps> this happened last time, too. You guys are the luckiest artist ever. Nothing in the ever. world to get paint on your hand. Hmm. This is the I just saw my face in the camera. Oh my god. Howdy. I was making a face. It was not a nice face. You have a nice face. <laughs> Unless it's pouty. Um, okay. So she's trying to fix my rock. In the my, in the meantime, I think I'm gonna steal her email. You will not. Oh, that looks cool. What does? How are you gonna get the polka dots on there? Very, very delicately. <laughs> How's this? Oh, Bunky's bunny looks amazing. You guys oh, need to see it. guys, I have a surprise. Dad said I might be able to get a bunny. Oh. Okay. Bunky wants to get a bunny, and Dad said it might have perfect. My bunny. Do y'all like parent paint? <laughs> Do y'all like parenting in art? <laughs> Wait, I don't parent. Do you like painting and art? I think I, I think I didn't because I'm not good at it or something, not visual arts at least. I don't actually care for I'm painting that much because um, she's a perfectionist. So she yeah. probably has the same issue that you did. Um, she's a perfectionist and she ends up not liking her art because it's very cute. Whereas I've always been very, very visual and like, yeah, I'm not happy with this avocado. The circle isn't round and like, the outline isn't as nice as I'd like it to be. It's not right. The 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 lighting in the eyes isn't how I would have wanted it to be. But I mean, looking at it in the camera, I can't see any of that stuff. So it it's not that bad. So I don't mind. And I've always liked um, drawing and being able to use that creative aspect of my mind. Hey. As often as I can. Uh, Mr. Jason, we don't have a pink. I'm going to have to use like a hot pinkish. Did for you the show outline. the bunny? I did. It would put it over That's my awesome. face. That's awesome. Miss Lori is uploading a garden update. Nice. Nice. Miss Lori is good with paint. Miss Lori is very good at paint. And she's really good at um, blending colors. 
Oh, this is a very thick outline. Mm. Should have done the outline first and okay. painted over it. Mix red with pink if you want a good pink. No, I got something I'm working Look. on. Hot pink. Okay, so the outline is done, but I'm going to have to draw the nice. purple over it. Because it didn't work out. Peeking over at Funky stuff, she's doing some cool, some cool stuff with colors. Because mm -hmm. she's smart. Thank you. You're welcome. Give me some purple. I'm making a sunset on a napkin. See, I love oh, nice. cats a lot. Good. I can't draw cats at all. <laughs> <laughs> like, this isn't working. You can draw a cat. It's too big. It's okay. And this always happens. You can be a little cat. I'm going to add some white to the background. You can be a big cat that's up close. Or a little kitty that's up close. Yeah. What? What? Why a little kitty that's up close? Because it looks like a zoom. And she wanted a small kitty. Uh, yeah. I'm really bad with scale. I, I can't scale things in my head the way they're supposed to be. So, like, if I'm trying to take an image and duplicate it, like, eek. Yeah, I've had a little bit of trouble with that. I drew a really nice picture of Alfie once, and I was able to scale it up for a bigger size, mm. and it was on a very small piece of paper. Right. And, like, I wasn't able to draw it right again. Right. And so I just had to stick with the one that was small mm. and hang that one up on the wall. Mm. I don't know what happened to that piece of art. I was really proud of it. Mm. It's in my, I think it's Jason in my, CLJ um, says he's always sure. wanted to write music, like create a new music scale or maybe an old 12 note. And I actually was thinking about that a lot this week. Um, Dad was watching a video on something called the Solfeggio scale. And basically that was before the early 1900s when they, when they decided to um, change the tuning key standard of A to, I think it was 440 hertz. Before that, it was slightly lower, and I've noticed this in older music. Um, the one that immediately comes to mind is the theme from Greece. I can remember like play, playing around with it on piano, so I have it like going in through the piano so I can hear it. And then I'm with Dad, and we're trying to go over like what Bunky can do in the song. And I can't play the note on the piano because it's not the same note, and it drives me crazy because like I, I can tell the difference between those pitches really well and it's it, it was annoying because like it doesn't it doesn't make sense um so then you have like their a is in between the a and the b flat and it's just like right in there and it drove me insane but that's because the pitch. it's because the the scale of music actually only changed in the last hundred years or For so those of you who aren't aware she's perfect pitch <laughs> Um, so yeah, instead of 440, it used to be 432 hertz. Um, so it's just like it's slightly more sharp than it used to be, but only by a little bit. So the solfeggio scale is a scale that some scientists are using to look at the positive effects that it has on people. Like it makes them more relaxed and less stressed. And so that was kind of interesting to think about. And especially, and it's like it's interesting to think about that you're bringing up the new scale or an old 12 note scale because the old 12 note scale would actually be in a different key than the scales we use today so that would actually be really cool to look into and don't they have like a different mental effect on people yeah it makes them um less stressed which is a really interesting that thing that they change right um the person in the video brought up that like people didn't really start rioting around music until elvis presley which is around the time that they changed the scale. Huh. Interesting. Very interesting. Kelly Green. Who's Kelly? Oh. All right. The emu sty is done. It's okay. I've got a big rock. I'm nice. doing another rock. Okay. Hold on. Oh, I meant to do a rainbow. We have to start it. Use a wider brush now. Yeah, I don't know my view on changing the hertz. I'm more thinking of instead of A to G, using A to L. I'm not sure what you mean by L. That'd be that'd be interesting to look into. Sorry. 
So you're saying like make an entirely new scale with different notes? Entirely new notes? We're using acrylic paint. Um, Mr. Charles, we're using acrylic paint and little paint brushes. Is that bushcraft family? No, uh, no. Phil and Arkansas. Oh, no. Oh. But bushcraft was here. We oh. like using acrylic because we are messy children. We are. And it in acrylic is very, very easy to clean up. We're messy children. Messy, messy, messy children. It's got a very floofy tail on it. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's a duck. <laughs> It's not a dog. Oh it's a God, dog. No, it's such a dog. Not. He's not a dog. Calm down. It's fine. Notation. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L. Oh. Hi, I've Bumpy. only ever used it to G. Extending it Charles cool. Bushcraft said hi, Bumpy. So, like, instead of using F sharp, you would just Say use hi, that Bumpy. as another note? Hi. Bucky says hi. Bunky. <laughs> yeah, he's got like a Cheshire cat tail going on. You should give him blue eyes. Cheshire cat blue eyes. Yeah, I was, yeah, I was yeah, gonna go in and look like a crazy. No, thing. I don't want him to look crazy. I want him to look cute. Cheshire cat is cute in his own way. In his own way? <laughs> he is. He's the cutest cat of all time. Yes, he is. I would actually be very freaked out if there was an actual cat that looked like the Cheshire cat. So. I would not. I think that would be really cool. So I'm I would also progress. think I'd fall into a rabbit hole. So yeah. that's my little cat outline for no now. No sharps or flat. I ramble on and on about one subject. Oh, that's so super cool. She. <laughs> she will not stop talking about like one thing forever. For all eternity. It'll just be that one topic. See, I'm annoying like that. You're not annoying like that. It's, it's just can I have that, you do. that Can I have that one? It's not so. annoying. Oh, wait. No, you already wet it. You already did that. I'm going to use some white, and I'm going to make some of these weird-looking bubbles. Weird-looking bubbles. Eh? All right. Let's do it. <gasps> I don't actually know why there's bubbles in the picture. Because the cat's underwater. The cat is not underwater. The cat's totally underwater. Why else would there be bubbles? Where else do you even find bubbles? In the air after being blown. Okay, yeah. There was a little kid by the cat in the creepy forest with the water around it. Paint. That was blowing bubbles. Yeah. For the, for the cat. Yeah. Paint. Yep, that's what we're going with. Paint. Paint. Paint his bubbles. <laughs> one of my random, one of my rambling kind. <laughs> we will block you. Night bot night. Nightbot might. Nightbot does that. Well, you know what I could have done? I could have made them like dandelions. Like her emo. Like like the emo? No, just like make them kind of blotchy. Yeah. You could do that. Really how, how would I do that? Because like I, now I got these three random dots. <laughs> That's easy. You go like this to your brush. Bushcraft family like... says hi, Bunky. I'm not sure if you saw that. Yeah. Hi, children. Nah. Aha! Uh -huh. Thank you. No, yeah, but like, there's something weird with the white. The white's like a very hard. Well, if you don't like it, you can always dab a little something on top of it. Hello, Strong's Adventures. Hi, Strong's. Hello, Mr. I was going to go to bed early for once on Saturday night until one of the neighbors decided to share their base and the house windows are red. Like, oh no! Oh no! That's sad. Yeah, our no, don't get it too close to his face. Just like too. Oh, yeah, I get very mad at these neighbors sometimes. I have to put my paint brushes in water with the water. Oh well. Look. Look, you made a big blue. I made blue water. Interesting. It's interesting water. I have no idea what I'm going to do for the. Is that a map? I need the very, very thin brush. What is that? That looks is a key. Like, doesn't look like a cat. Right? <gasps> it looks like a boy. Oh, look. It's a kitty. Did you see it? Oh, I'm looking at the picture. Yeah, it's oh. a kitty. It's a kitty cat. It's in dark lighting. It looks like a boy to me. It's, it's a boy cat. cat. Not a boy cat. Why are you looking at boys? Yeah. Come on, dude. Leave it. 
I'm just saying. All right. Uh, I got a gray. Um, Yay, you got a gray. Show me in this thing. In this thing? Yeah. Which tell, tells time? The, the rabbit? <laughs> oh, my gosh. Yes, the rabbit. I was quoting the Christmas story, but, yeah, the rabbit tells time. Yeah, Alice in Wonderland. The rabbit. This thing that Treasure tells time. What Christmas story thing are you talking about? The little boy from the Christmas story when he wrote the essay about his um, BB gun. Uh-huh. And he said, it has a compass and stock and this thing which tells time. And he was acting like that was such great poetry. Oh. Got I it. love that scene because I hate poetry. So here's Bunky's minion and Bunky's bunny. Which is about to be bunny. No. Mm -mm, bunny. Don't worry. Yeah, yeah, this is not going very well. Yeah, 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 yeah. So speaking of that, um, we uploaded the one take cover of Red Hot Chili Peppers Under the Bridge, and I actually it's really like so how that turned good. out. It, it actually did turn out having some pretty full sound as far as we go. Under the bridge, down. So that was fun. It was a pretty fun one to record, too. And so I was really happy with how that one turned out. Uh, we just really saw, where did we put that up on book? Um, vineyard Chicks. Vineyard Chicks. It's on the Vineyard Chicks channel. That was good to edit. That was yeah. Very fun to edit, it looks cool. And then Bunky did some really cool trick on it where she coded something. Oh, yes. I coded my own code. Yeah, program. Bunky w learned how to code and oh, she extracted the audio of my voice only from the phone. No, everyone's voice. Oh, everyone's she, voice. she extracted the audio from the file, which oh. is really cool. Like, we don't know how to do that. Mom and Dad don't know how to do that. That was a completely all bunky thing. And everybody is so proud of her. I'm about to listen to that bridge song. I listened to them. I don't anymore, though. We listened to them a little bit. Like, just that song and, like, one other because Dad likes them before we were concepts. So then he had to edit out a lot of his playlists. Hey, don't nudge me. I'm doing some fine line work. Take me, take me okay. to Funky Town. Take me, take me to. He looks like he's trying to back away from the leaves. Funky Town. She's actually kind of cute. Did you know there's another color in between purple and blue? Yeah, Violet. Indigo. Indigo. Indigo tomatoes, of course. Guess it's not always better, lol. Take me, take me to. Bunky Town. Jason CLJ looks like he's playing hot potato in the chat. Huh? Ooh. I don't know how to, how to do that. How do you play hot potato? What's hot potato? Hopefully Strong's Avengers can sleep in. That, that's unfortunate. That neighbors can be like that. Okay, look what so. I made. You have a potato now, Dad. What are you going to do with your potato? I think he's going to eat the potato. Sure. Dad likes potatoes. Um, what is I it? guess earplugs What's on happening? silent space, yeah. What's happening? Yeah, because you can feel it. Right. It's vibrations. I'm sorry. What's happening? Mr. Maybe Strong's you could adventures. suspend yourself via bungee cord from the rafters of your ceiling. Yeah. What? <laughs> suspend yourself in the air via bungee cords by the rafters in your ceiling. Why? So that the base won't bother you. Because you can usually feel the base in the floor, in the ground. Vibrating. Okay, first off, don't do that. That's dangerous. Second off, why? Uh, I don't know. That sounds fun. His eye messed up. It melted a little bit, but that's okay. It makes it more unique. It does not look ugly. That may be my favorite minion rock ever. I've seen many on the, on the internet while we're trying to find ideas. And that's my favorite one ever. Well, I like it. There's something wrong with the white. It's very clumpy. Yeah. There. Done. Like, it's very hard to get it to blend with anything because it's just so clumpy. <laughs> hey. Can I have this? Sure. 
So it's eleven o'clock, and I think we're all pretty much done with our rocks. Hey, except for KK, who's almost done with our rock. Yeah, just giving another update. He's got some weird eyes going on now. Oh, he's cute. That looks he's good got over eyes. Mr. Dave loves minions. Okay, well here. How does he like that minion? It's a very cool minion. It's a very cool minion. Is that acrylic watercolor? No, it's just acrylic paint. Um, it's I acrylic ca craft paint. And here's Bunky's bunny. And she's gonna get some bunnies. That's why Bunky and Mr. Dave get along. Yeah, it's so just well. acrylic paint. Um, you're gonna realize that like when you start using it, it's a very thick paint. But I like the consistency. Which makes it color better. You can see less of the rock's original color. Here's KK's fox. He kind of sits like Fox. He's cute. Mine sits like Toothless. And here's Kiki's little cat. He's a very fluffy cat. He turned out much better than very I thought. Fluffy cat. Here's my avocado dedicated to my dear sister. Hello. Who loves avocados? Hello. And here's my emu dandelion wearing a bow tie. Or just a tie. And special thanks to Miss Lori and Jason CLJ for helping me decide what kind of tie to make. Also, and I think Bunky wants, wants to show her. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. Bunky wants to show her minion. Her minion. Put down the minion. Here's her minion. I totally pictured Dave in a minion shirt. <laughs> oh yeah, we should send him one. We should send him and Bunky have. They hey, can have matching hey, minion shirts. Look. Trey's a bunny. No, Trey's an avocado. It doesn't work like that. Yes, it does. Don't touch my avocado. I don't want it to smear. It doesn't work. It does. Ooh, ooh. See? I'm an avocado. That would be the perfect shape for bunny. How much are you charging for them? We're not. I want to keep these. <laughs> I want to keep them. They're my first pet rocks. They're cool. You can give Trey, KK, get KK's um, detention rock. My detention rock. Detention rock. I was not in detention. Your obedience rock. How many times have you guys? So been the in the rock, rock that KK made had two faces on it. It had on one side it said what did it say? I don't remember. It was a sad face and it was just like, was it lines? Something like that. And it was just the like, other side. It had this a smiley face. Oh look, the Benadryl tried. How dare you? So here's the avocado. And there's the cause of all of her problems. That little Benadryl right there. That's not very tray shaped. The cause of all my problems is shaped <laughs> like a tray. <laughs> not obeying. It used to have two eyes. And it's a it used face. to have two eyes. It was in fifth grade. That was six years ago. There was a sad face that said not obeying. And then and so the smiley she, face is being good. So when she was being bad, it said not obeying, and she would have the rock facing like this. But when she was being good, it said um, being good. It didn't say anything. It's no, it didn't. Good. I don't see it. I see it, so say it. Where? Green. Green. That's the smiley face. Yeah, yeah, there's nothing there. This just so, a smiley And when face. she's being good, it's a smiley face. And you know the amount of times I would walk into her bedroom and it was like this? Like what? <laughs> I never paid attention to it. So she was just like, oh, I'm not being good right now. I'm going to change the obedience rock. And then she'd forget about the obedience rock and it was always bad. Is this your first step to hard rock? I don't know. Oh, <laughs> yes, yes. Oh my gosh! Yes, it is hard rock. It is very hard rock. Let me try. Is mine hard rock? Ow! That was ow! <laughs> yes, yours is a very hard rock. This is just, just became bully trade night. Yeah, that was mean. What about KK? No! <laughs> I don't want to be hit by the obedience rock, please. <laughs> the obedience rock. I should need this. He's looking at you. You do need them. We should all get obedience rocks. Hey. 
But oh, anyway, so it's 11.05 um, our time. So we're going to go ahead and end the broadcast now. But thank you guys all for coming. We really appreciate it. We had a lot of fun making funny looking rocks with you guys. <laughs> funny looking. They are funny looking. Funky, hold up your rock. Okay, mine looks cuter on camera. Actually. You can't really see the emu unless I hold it closer. So I'm going to hold it up here. <laughs> Boogie's hiding. Don't get painted in my hair. <laughs> But anyway, okay, get off. Get off. I can't breathe. Get Have off. a good night, you guys. We will see you tomorrow morning at early um, 10 30 a.m. Um, joyful noise and at, notes. And joyful noise and notes for some Sunday morning worship. Um, and then Mon <gasps> Monday night at 9 p.m. Eastern time for our Monday night live, which is going to be our Father's Day live. So we hope to see you guys there. Um, have a great week if we don't. Um, and good night. God bless. Miss Laura likes a fox. Ah, yes. Yay. Better. Good night, everyone. Ah.